Do you want early access? Do you want uncut reactions? If so, then check out our Patreon. Link in the description down below. And now, it seems as though uh, we're going to be getting into the meat of uh, this show. Uh, or this season, rather. Because we went on the trip, and we went on a little journey. Encountered a talking mole, and a talking raven. And now we hear about this... Uh, and he didn't say nevermore yet. No, that's true. That is very true. If he qu- starts quoting Edgar Allan Poe... I'm My disappointment is immeasurable. Oh, I'm, just, I'm just kidding. Yeah. I was going to say, that's a stereotypical <clears throat> thing. But it seems as though we're getting to the... Uh, no pun intended on the episode title of this, but the core of uh, this season. Like, we're getting into like what the main story of this season is going to be about. Uh, so... They're Maybe. On, they're Maybe on the mainland, not. or Ch- mainland China, rather, and it seems as though... Like, this season has 24 episodes, so yeah. I'm not seeing them staying here for much longer, and I bet but there's going to be some this... more goings on, but I think this is a big plot thing that's going to be happening right here mid-season, though. Yeah, and I also think it, it'll probably have an effect on the later half of the season, too. Could be, yeah. I mean, I think so. That's, that's what I'm thinking, anyway. But, anyway... Uh, Got this episode queued up here. Let's give it a watch. Let's see what happens. Here we go. Yes, it is. <laughs> that doesn't answer the question. <laughs> what? I don't. Did you just have a stroke, Arthur? Uh-oh. Take out the ads first, then deal with the boss. Yeah. <laughs> oh crap. He's going for, He's going for Tomaki. Oh no! Treat him how he's got a fucking hole all the way through him. What? What? Huh? Huh? What? 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 <laughs> Just break the fourth wall. I think he did. <laughs> Juggernaut, he's just like, I'm fine. It's like, oh my god, he's been ripped apart. He's surely done. Nope, I'm good. I'm good. That was a pretty cruel trick, I have to say. Like, I was like, oh, I was Juggernaut. He punched a fucking hole in his chest. I was like, god, was like they killed Jesus. Juggernaut. Oh, shit. I Ooh, liked him. I like Juggernaut. His parents are going to be so sad now. Yeah, and then and he was just like, I'm good. Thankfully, he didn't hit anything. For it's to like, fucking off. hell. Like, is he in his fucking coat like this? Like, what the <laughs> I fuck? I don't know. <laughs> I, honestly, maybe that's a mystery we'll figure out later. <laughs> Ooh. Damn. Damn, son. That's Dark Souls, boss. Oh, 
石板のあるエリアで囲んでいたあれは何だ白羽の矢鍵穴に矢のようなものが刺さってるな全部で7本それも矢尻が鍵のようになっている<笑>鍵穴に刺さっているのを入れて白羽の矢両方から連想されるのは一つの言葉生贄にえご神体もアマテラスも動力はアドラバーストとくれば<音声>やっぱりジョーカーが秘密裏に調べていた通り生贄にえってもしかしてこの中にはいおそらくはスコップの言う黒の女性である可能性が高い神羅君がこの建築物とリンクしたのも納得いくんだでもレオーグ時間を稼いでくれうまくいけば鬼を侵攻できるかもしれないはあタムあなたはスコップたちの言うこのご神体を作った女性ですよね俺に伝道者のような加護を与えられませんか Wish I was that ripped. I think we all do, man. Wait a second. Is he gonna become like the actual god of. Yeet! <laughs> I mean, either way, he's gonna soften him up for Shinra. It'll be hilarious if he just kills him right here somehow. Somehow, some way. Use your flaming stuff, dude. Your shoot, your missiles. Stretch their legs there a little bit in terms of like fighting the the demon on the outside. Uh, Ogun showing off just how much of a fucking like like tank he is. Yeah, I mean besides like them discussing pie at the beginning of the episode, that episode was almost like straight up action the whole time. Yeah, 
And of course, you know, Juggernaut, us being worried about him, and then all of a sudden, yeah. just, he's like, I'm fine. This is like one of the cruelest tricks I've ever seen in anime. I was like, no, this anime just killed a really cool character. I wasn't expecting that at all. I'm good. <laughs> it's like, uh, I can't remember, but as far as I remember, like, there aren't really any major character deaths in Soul Eater that I can remember, so. Uh, well, maybe he doesn't like killing his characters. I don't know. Yeah. Or he does, or maybe he will. I don't know. Just, I guess it depends. I mean, Harry Potter's pretty much the same way, save for a few here and there. Yeah. I mean, none of the main three die. Well, there's still a few major characters that do die, though. Well, yeah, but none of the main three or like... Yeah. Or, hell, even, like, some of the... Even their extended villains. friend group. Like. Yeah. Because the... Because... Uh, I know George, uh, George Weasley, spoilers, uh, he goes, but, yeah, other than and, that, uh, I mean, Snape. Well, Snape, yeah, but, that one's, <clears throat> that one's a specific type of, a specific type of, like, character, because we believed him to be a villain for so long, and then the turn happened, where we're like, oh, shit, he wasn't a villain, turns out he was actually actually trying to help and it's i'll be it for some skewed reasons but. very skewed but again you know in my opinion it wasn't necessarily like easy enough to say like oh he's actually a good guy it's just like oh well he wasn't actively like being evil no like, he was, so he was acting accordingly well keep in mind albus was the one who wanted severus to to basically be the one to kill him yeah, I was. I mean, like honestly, like he was kind of like it was like he was basically acting as a good guy, but he was just doing it for his own selfish reasons, basically. So. Yeah, yeah. It's un- again, it's one of those things. But I don't know if we get anything like that. In it's like, is it really years. good being a good guy if you're being a good guy for selfish reasons? Like, I guess. Yeah. It's kind of like superheroes and certain things that like only help because they want to get paid and shit. You know. True. He's like, I'm only helping because I really was in love with your mother. <laughs> That's sort of a weird one, but yeah. yeah. But eh, it is what it is. Anyway, yeah, I'm curious to see, you know, how Shinra's going to be able to handle the literal one second of time that he has. I'm guessing he's just going to basically do the whole thing that he did to uh, counter shows. Uh... Like, uh, what was it, like heat expansion or whatever? Yeah, his... Because Sho um, could literally, like, stop time. Yeah, and he, like, Shinra went so fast he just it. countered it. Yeah, Shinra could literally move so fast that it was as though he was expanding the universe mm. so fast. And, like, separating his own cells and moving yeah, he, faster than light. Yeah, so. he could literally pass through matter. That's fucking ridiculous. But... Because, yeah. I mean, if he's going in reverse by, like... Going faster than light, technically the one second will be extended a little longer than one second. It should be enough to oh, pull dude, off a blow be, that can take the demon out. I think, I think if he stretches that enough, he could probably have infinite time if he wanted to. Because if time, he went fast enough, but I don't know if he's capable of that yet. Not yet, but time on a relative scale. I mean, that might be closer to how he ends up beating like the final villain of the anime or something. Probably, uh, I don't know. <clears throat> But anyway, yeah, this is a this is a good one. This, I like this episode. Also, it's a pretty long uh, outro here. Is this uh, just the thing? And okay, the preview for the next time. All right, so that's gonna do it for this one, everyone. This was episode nine of season two, the core. Hopefully, you all enjoyed. And if uh, y'all want to see more, you know what to do. Hit that subscribe button, ring that bell to stay notified. And I guess until next time, signing off. I'm Nate. I'm Nick. We'll see you, everybody. Peace out.